You already know how to come up with the equation of a line using a lot of different methods. For example, you could be given a point and a slope and use the point-slope formula to come up for, with the equation of a line. With the vector equation of a line is very similar. Take a look at uh, our example here. We start with a point, just an arbitrary point, x0, y0, and then we define its position vector. Remember, a position vector is a vector going from the origin to our given point, and we'll call that r0. Next, let's define a direction vector, v. This will give us the direction that our line will go. And notice, I've drawn v so that it's head to tail with r, so that I can add the two together and I get r0 plus v. Now if I do this again, if I add a second v, I get r0 plus 2v. So this is still r0 plus v, this is r0 plus 2v. And I can do it again. I can add another v and get r0 plus 3v. Or I could take r0 and add a negative v to it. But you'll notice that all the points that I get that correspond to these position vectors are all on a line. And so the idea here is I can get any point on this line by adding an appropriate scalar multiple of v to r. So r plus some scalar multiple of v is going to give me any point on this line. And that suggests this equation. So this will be the vector equation for a line. r equals r sub 0 plus t times v. So the givens, what you need to have to get the uh, vector equation of a line is r0, some position vector for a given point, and v, a direction vector that tells you the direction that the line goes in.